Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Um, I hope everyone's doing well today. I've got a video I want to show sh show you something I, that I done last night. But anyway, the video's coming up is um, this flashlight that I'm going to show you. You can't really see it in the dark here, but this is a flashlight. You can see the top of the light. I'm going to zoom in on the light you'll see the stuff floating in the air sometimes that's from him uh, Kim trails and but anyway you don't see the light from this flashlight see there it is shining up you don't see that light but what I'm going to show you is a little bit of knowledge so you can't see that light through this camera like a like a ray of light you cannot see that ray of light but i want to show you uh on the videos coming up i got a couple little short videos coming up where i come out here and done this last night because i was trying to get a picture of all this dust up particles in the air that's coming from the, either the red dragon system or the chemtrails but they're alive you'll see those those that's not dust that's uh orbs it's atoms it's uh particles and they've been chemtrailing heavy here but y'all see that little bitty ray of light there So you don't see the, the ray of light, per se. But anyway, it might not show it tonight, but last night I'll show you what, it, what uh, the video that, uh, um, what it done last night. Those, that, that, it's still a little bit daylight, so you can see through those trees and stuff, but I want to uh, show you what happens when my eyes look at this ray supposed to be a ray of light there going up you can see it's kind of a center little ray it's a little colored um, that's kind of like rainbow colors you know but uh but anyway i'm gonna go put this add this to my the videos i took last night because videos i took last night i want to show you uh like the beginning the end from the beginning it's kind of the theme of this my whole videos but y'all see those uh particles in the air that's not dust that's particles from either the red dragon or the um, chemtrails but they control them with that d-wave computer and uh, that CERN over there in Switzerland and I done a little video about that CERN that is they put that right dead center over the place they believe the gateway to hell is so they're trying to uh, rise they're trying to resurrect Nimrod or Nero, Apollo is who they're trying to resurrect, and I think they've done done it. I really do think that they've done uh, resurrected Apollo, and I believe he's here on this earth. I believe the spirit of Apollo has came out of the bottomless pit, and he may have already entered a man, uh, because things on this earth has went from evil to good and good to evil. So anyway, well, I'm going to end this video right here because I don't want my videos too long. Um, if I don't have an ending to my other videos that I'm fixing to show you, well, I, I will. I'll end because I'm going to have to do a little bit of commentary on those videos that I've done last night. Take Doing the same thing with this flashlight. Okay, everyone, this is the videos I took the night before with my flashlight. Y'all can see the top of the flashlight. It's My camera's catching the top of that flashlight. But uh, what I want to show you here is last night, uh, my, my camera didn't capture a ray of light. It captured the, what, it captured the atoms, the particles in the air that um, you can't, you, you would think that speed, you know, they say the speed of light. That light ain't really moving. It's the reaction of the atoms. 
when you turn that light on but anyway you can see these atoms in there and my, i've got uh, another little video added onto this one here that you'll see in a minute that uh, i really zoomed in and out on these atoms um because um there are strange things happening in our world just like the bible says that's going to happen um but i'm going to show you that vesica pisces you can see the vesica pisces when those uh those two atoms are connected and it makes that place it, that little oval um shape in the middle but anyway this is the ray of light that y'all are seeing from this flashlight it's not really a ray of light it's just these atoms have reacted to the light turning on but you can see those are atoms y'all have seen my videos with the stars that's what the star is right there just a, a giant atom uh, you can see the shape uh, is the same as the stars that I'm recording. But anyway, y'all can see the different colors of blue and the, the bright white. Now that's a ray of light from a flashlight. I've done this last night, but uh, you can see the Vesica Pisces in there. Uh, they've misused it. They've, uh, they've corrupted everything of God's. But that's a connection, that Vesica Pisces right there. You can see that center piece right there. It's like two atoms connected to each other. A seed line right there would be like a seed, like a, like right there. Just say, for instance, there's your, you, your father, and your grandfather. It's a connection, a seed line. It's what is the best way I can describe that. But in there, there's that best Pisces. Uh, there it is again, but you can see the air is full of atoms and this is one of the reason for the mask and stuff They're making everybody wear because they're they're they've changed the atom structure I mean they've taken they're using some of these atoms that um, the, That uh, that creates oxygen when you breathe So they're starting this 5g. They're putting masks on everybody because they're needing all these uh, atoms, all these particles, to make the 5G work better. You know, that's one reason for that mask. Two is because it's, uh, they're, they're wanting to kill off, uh, the Georgia Guidestones say they want to get the population down to 500 million. The elite want their, only their bloodlines to be remain alive. And uh, so they're wanting the population to get down to that far. So they don't care what they do to you. I mean, they really don't care. They they want you gone from here. They want me and you gone because they believe there are the bloodlines. Well, here's what I believe after much research that these rulers, most of these kings are c cousins. And I mean, they are in the same bloodlines. The, I think it, I don't know how to pronounce it right, Merbogian or Merbogenian. These are the bloodlines of Jesus Christ and Mary Magdalene. Uh, Mary Latour is her real name. Magdalene was just a title, but anyway. Um, what, what, and they believe they are the ones that should run this world. They've corrupted this bloodline you know, these bloodlines, but there's a few, I mean, there's quite a few uh, people in these, this Mervogian bloodline, however it's pronounced, that there's more and more evidence coming up that Jesus was married and had two children uh, with this Mary. But anyway, and I would, the Christian world's taught us that Jesus didn't get married, didn't have kids, he was celibate, but uh, that's not what the rabbis taught back then. The, the Catholics kind of teach that. You know, but uh, and some of the Catholic. But anyway, I'm gonna get back to this. This is a ray, flashlight ray, right here. Um, and y'all can see it showed me the particles in there, the atoms in the air. It's showing the Vesica Pisces, and um, it's gonna go along with this red dragon. What I'm coming to, the beginning, the end from the beginning, and y'all can see those different colors of those. Uh, some of those are different colors. You see some blue, some oranges colored ones, you know. Uh, these are probably atoms that's been coded differently or they're being used by um, bone signal, TV signals, or something like that, you know, or even the light, the flashlight may be causing them to turn. But you can see these are what's making the light. The light ain't going at 200 and something thousand miles an hour. The, the atoms are just reacting to what the light was switched on. 
it's all got to do with plasma magnetics and um, that's what uh, and and vibration is what this how all these react because we were created from uh, energy vibration and frequency and that's what um, the, how these are coded <clears throat> they are coded to uh, for us to breathe for us to to view a just say a tree um, that's how these are coded I mean it's uncomprehendable there's no way a, a human being can comprehend the uh, God anyway there's no way that uh, that I could even begin to comprehend I ask for the truth. Uh, I seek the whole truth, you know, and uh, it's all, it's been hid from us. It's been hid from us who we are. Uh, we've been taught over here in America, most of, especially where I live, that we were Gentiles or Indians or savages or, you know, whatever, but it was all lies. Uh, and now they come after me because they say I'm figuring out finding the truth. And, uh, but anyway, but these are the light particles. Um, they're reacting to the flashlight turning on through magnetics and ha however it works. But that you don't see the ray of light. You know, like like they say, the speed of light is two two hundred sixty something thousand miles an hour, or whatever it is. But you don't see that light shooting up like that. It, these just react. They come on. And that's how fast they, they, um, the light spreads through the sky or whatever, you know, it just, they all turn on at about the same time. And uh, I mean, it's absolutely amazing to me, but, um, but anyway, that's what the stars are right there. Luminaries, lights, they're atoms, uh, the red dragon. Uh, God is spirit. We cannot even comprehend that really. Uh, the Bible says we must worship him in spirit and in truth. We cannot comprehend as a human beings uh, through a carnal mind, a fleshly mind, uh, God's ways. His ways are not our ways. So you have to start. I try to figure it out. You know, I, I won't know till I get till I get to heaven or wherever. I, I mean, nobody will really comprehend very a lot of it, I don't believe. But uh, this is a. Um, uh, th there's something changed in the atom world, in the particle world, in our reality. There's a lot of things changing. Um, and the Mandela effect where uh, words are changing in the Bible, they're changing on like the Monopoly game. Um, I grew up playing that Monopoly quite a bit. Well, I grew up with the little, the little man on there had a, a, a little eyeglass. But now the the little Monopoly man does not have an eyeglass up there on over covering holding it up over to one of his eyes. It's not there no more. Um, I grew up with him having the glass. A lot of people grew up with him not having it. You know, I mean, well, they thought think they grew up with him not having that eyeglass. Um, the company says there never was an eyeglass. That the the little Monopoly man never had the eyeglass. Well, this is a this is a uh, um, memory uh, replacement, memory reprogrammed. Because the people that believe that he did not have that eyeglass, they believe that with everything inside of them. They believe that that's how their history from playing that game, if they're my age, and grew up playing Monopoly, and they don't remember the eyeglass, that's how they. That's how it is, and it's real. It is real to them because it reprogrammed that seed line, and that vesica Pisces is the connection that travels down that seed line. Even in reverse, it goes all the way back, and then they don't remember. That's how the game was to them. The guy didn't have the eyeglass uh, because it went in reverse because it goes backwards down that seed line it's connected with like the vesica pisces the two seeds connected and it's a seed line just like your genealogy is a seed line um but anyway i got a little bit off subject there uh, maybe but uh thank y'all for coming to my channel y'all please share my videos uh if you can understand them i'm not a good teacher i just uh i see things different than most everybody
not everybody, but most everybody. Um, and I'm allowed to take videos of them, of what I see, and make YouTube videos of them. But YouTube does not. They, I, I tried to upload one video three times. It took me one week to upload one video, and uh, so they're they're st trying to stop us people that are seeking the whole real truth because these evil rulers of this world do not want us to know the real truth because the, the, the tribes of Israel has talents. They have special powers of intuitions and things like that They that was, in, was gave to them by God. It's inside their blood, inside their DNA, coded in their DNA, these special talents. Well, they don't want these tribes of Israel to waking up realizing their special talents that God give them. Um, and um, anyway, thank you all for coming to my videos. I'm asking ask you to share them, like them. And if you click the like button, well, it um, helps promote it further. So thank you all for coming.